Hey guys, and welcome back to the channel. Today, I just want to talk about our mindset and inspiration. I know you've been hearing throughout the week of uh, me talking about double downing on uh, YouTube. I have brought other videos to you about Canva, which I will still do. Don't get me wrong. Uh, how to design in Canva. Uh, Pinterest uploads, Instagram reels and stories and things of that nature. But, but I did find myself while doing all those things, not teaching them, but trying to do them behind the scenes, made it extremely difficult for me to move forward and really understand what my purpose was in doing this business. You see, as you know, I've been on the internet for quite some time, maybe eight years or so. And at that time, I, I wasn't really, I was studying. I did all that time I was studying. So basically, you can say, I pretty much have a master's or maybe let's even say a PhD in uh, YouTube or, or business, period, because I've been studying so many different businesses and I, I pretty much understand the ins and outs. See, where my problem lie more or less is with uh, the shiny object syndrome. I would see one thing and I would work on it and then I would see another business model. I was like, oh, that's, you know, that looks good. Let's try that. Then I would see another business model and then I would be like, ah, oh, let me try that. And then I would look back at what I was doing. And then when I see no progress, what happens? I quit. That's it. I quit. I just stopped because I got frozen because I wasn't seeing results and I didn't understand why. And it was because all that time when I was learning, I was learning things about business, but I needed a, a base foundation. I needed to have a better understanding of what I was doing, it, why I was doing it, and give myself goals and a timeline. And I mean, honestly, guy, realistically, they tell you to give yourself at least three months. And I'll be honest with you, three months is not a lot of time. It's really not a lot of time to get enough information, uh, even with the uh, algorithm or even looking at your analytics. If And also, depending upon how many times you're posting, you really do not get enough information. That's just bottom line. You will not get enough information. So basically, I changed my goal. I changed my goal to saying, you know what? I'm going to do it until it works. So now, since I've decided to double down on YouTube... I'm going to make it happen until it works. I don't have another option. We have seen the state of what's going on in the world today. And we all know, guys, right now, having that one income, it's not a safe bet. It's really not a safe bet. And um, at this time, businesses... It, it it might not be your business. It might not be my my business, my um place of work. But you just never know when people hit tough times, and when businesses hit tough times, they have to do what they have to do. As much as we hate it, but businesses are in the business of making money, and until we understand that, you know, things just happen. And that's why I want to encourage so many of you is to work every day on your mindset. I think for me, I am going to start journaling uh, in the morning after a morning prayer, just a good journal, just to dump everything out and of how I feel and see where things are. But I'm also going to continue to work on being positive, uh, Always be open to learning. Always continue to learn. Don't think that you know everything. I don't care how long I've been on this internet. I do not know everything and I still have a long way to go. So I'm never going to stop learning. Now, do I have a lot of information? Heck yeah. I know a lot of stuff, you know, but at the same time, when you're constantly changing directions and understand the difference, pivoting and changing directions are two different things. Because when you do a pivot, you're going to do that right within your business. You're not changing your business model. You might be changing your strategies. And that's okay. But also, you want to be careful even when pivoting too often. Because again, like I said, you got to give things time to work. You know, sometimes it can hit you in the face immediately. And you know, okay, hey, wait, 
I made a boo-boo. Let me go back and let me redo this. But then again, you can also pivot and stay on the right track. You just have to know when. You got to be open to, to learning more, understanding your business, and most of all, understanding who you are. Understanding what it is that you want to deliver to others. Understand what is it that you want to help others achieve. Okay? They always said that the more people you help, the richer you become. And I want to help as many people as possible. Do I want to make a little money in the process? Sure. But I want to see everyone else succeed as well. Not just me. I want to see others on the internet. I want to see my family members. I want to see friends of my family members succeed. Remember, there's enough out here for everyone to have. There's enough money, entertainment, enjoyment for everyone. So teach as much as you can, you know, help as much as you can. And another thing is understand that the things that people have learned and 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 understand and are teaching, don't be that one that says, Oh well, like why are you selling us your your uh, products? Why you just can't teach them to us? Do you go to the university for free? I mean, do you just walk into a university and say, "Hey, can you just teach us for free?" No, they're not. And you know what you're going to get from a university? You're going to get theory. I don't know about you, but when I went to college, the teachers that were teaching me, a lot of them, especially my business. Uh, class never owned a business, never ran a business, and never managed a business. But yet, they taught business ownership, business management, and how to start a business. How can you do that if you've never put your hands into that environment? I'm just saying, guys, the mindset is everything. If you don't believe that you can do this, if you don't believe that uh, starting a business is for you, then maybe it's not. Maybe you need to do freelance work. But the best thing I can tell you right now is to do something. you got to do something. You can't just sit around and wait for things to happen to you. you got to make things happen for you. Okay? Guys, thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you so much for taking time to watch my video. And I will see you guys next time. Okay? Bye. Okay, guys. Listen up. We all know how tough it can be to start a business these days, especially with all the noise on the internet. If you're feeling stuck and don't know where to begin, don't stress. I've got your back with my done for you digital products. They're fully packed with everything you need, not just to get started, but to scale your business as it grows. And guess what? You're not in this alone. I'll be right there with you, guiding you every step of the way. The time is now, people. Let's do this. Click the link in the description box below, and I'll see you next time.